The stage is set for the WBCA Youth and Grand Parades on Thursday and Saturday, with bleachers set up along San Bernardo. Chairs tied to poles also line parts of the parade route, but they're by people vying for the best seats in the house. Lupita Aldaco has worked along the parade route for five years. She says the chairs have been lined up since Tuesday afternoon. I'm already used to it. Uh, I see this every year, so it's not surprising. It might be surprising for other people, but for us it's, it's usual. But you can't sit up just anywhere. People have been known to camp out, which the police department says is allowed, as long as you don't leave your vehicle unattended. Natalie Hernandez has worked for the WBCA for 12 years and says tailgating before the big parade gets bigger every year. There's always different ideas. You go from um, flatbeds to different areas that uh, camp, uh, their tents are set up and then they have their chairs, but it's definitely a big hype and I think uh, people in Laredo like to do that. The best thing to do if you're not sure about parking near business, Aldaco says, is check with the property owner to be sure you don't get your car towed. They're already starting to get set up for the Thursday parade, for the night parade. Um, do you can see a few chairs back here and usually they come to the office and they'll ask permission but since we're open all day we cannot permit them to stay here. Now businesses have the luxury of renting out seats but it doesn't mean you can't sit in front of one. As long as you don't block their driveway or stand in private property, this whole street is fair game. A lot of traffic, especially pedestrian traffic, is expected for the parades. Laredo PD says if you aren't going to attend the parades, avoid the area.